Now when we have the events tracking configured, let's see how these work with the leads collected. All leads captured on a website form electronic CRM. It tracks all visitors and their data for simple segmentation and nurturing. It's got all leads card with detailed events and conversation history and lead properties. The card also shows what segments a lead belongs to. On the right, we find conversation history, the emails and pop-ups sent to this lead, along with the conversations in chat. All events are grouped, and you can quickly find the one that you need. You can also initiate communication with this lead right from the leads card. Send a message to chat, and the user will see it when back to your website. Show a pop-up, which again will be on the screen when the lead visits your website, or send an email. All type of messages can be composed right here. You can also refresh the leads card to get the up-to-date information, as the card is not updated automatically in real time. If you and your colleague are discussing something about a particular lead, just copy the link to the card for a quick share. Different visitors come to your website and different users work with your product. They take different actions on your website and within your service, so better talk to them about what they are interested in. Personal communication depends on segments, which are formed with lead properties and lead events. For example, you are running a special offer to those who are from the US. In Lead Properties, choose Country, then Equals, and then write United States. Dashly forms a list of leads who fall under this criteria. Tick the leads you want to address, or select them all. You can also specify one more property, for example, email address. Then tick all leads. Apart from communication, you can add text to the leads, export them, send email subscription confirmation, or hide these leads. Let's try sending them a pop-up. We can form it right here or insert the contents from the template. Pop-ups can be created with the help of a pop-up editor or pop-up builder. It is possible to change the message type. You can send the message right now or schedule the sending. Not only leads properties help you form the audience, lead events are here as well. Choose an event and then the criteria for forming the list of leads. Events can be defined by the number of performances, date of the first or last event.
When created, any segment can be saved. You can later use a segment when sending manual messages or launching an auto message. Also, the name of a segment is displayed in the leads card when the lead matches the criteria of a segment. Apart from segments, you can add tags to leads. Tag is a special mark which you can add to a lead or group of leads, so you can easily find them and segment in future. The difference between segments and tags is that tags do not change dynamically and are to be set manually. You can include and exclude tags during segmentation. Segmentation and tags help you to address the right people. Later, you can always check the report on the manually sent messages. The campaign report page is the list of all messages sent. You can look at all of them or show a certain type of messages. A report gives you the statistics on how many messages were sent or bounced, who read the message, who replied to it, who clicked on the link in the message, who unsubscribed from your campaigns, and who marked as spam. The visitors page shows a more detailed report. Dashly offers three types of communication a message in chat, a pop-up, and an email. Communication can be initiated straight from the lead section. Choose a segment or format. Tick the leads you'd like to address and choose a type of message. Form it right here. You can send a message right now or schedule. Not only manual messages can be sent in Dashly, Auto messages make communication with your leads autonomous.